Hey guys, Shivam here back with another YouTube video. So today we're going to go over how email warm-up works and why it's essential and what softwares I recommend you use for your email warm-up. So just to go over what email warm-up is and why you need it. So basically when you buy a new domain and you start sending out emails from it, obviously when you send out emails, you're not going to get a response to every email. So your client can mark you as spam. So for example, Google can mark you as spam or whatever you're using as your uh, partner client would mark you as spam. So the point of warming up your email basically is that it's an automated form of sending out emails and getting replies back. So it tricks Google into sending you an active inbox who's not doing cold email or who's not doing anything spammy. So that is essentially the crux of it and why you need to do it because I recommend at least 14 days of warm up before you start sending out any emails. Otherwise, you'll just land in the spam inbox. And if you go into the spam inbox, then there's no way you're going to be able to judge the performance of your cold email or how your cold email has performed for you till then. So I have made a list of both softwares that I use and I recommend for your cold email warm up. So yeah, let's just get into it. So as you can see, we've got warm up inbox as our first one. So it's an email service that automatically raises your email sending reputation through the network of inboxes talking to each other. So like I said, cold warm up basically is that they take emails, they send it to another email and then they reply back to the email, essentially creating a conversation. And this conversation leads to Google into believing that you're not sending out cold emails. So the advantage of warm up inbox is it offers you a seven day free trial. And after that, it's just nine dollars per inbox per month. This is one of the best and one of the cheapest I've used in terms when it comes to pricing and offering a free trial because a lot of the warm up tools that are in currently in the market don't do that or don't offer that. It's also very good if you already have a bad email reputation. So for example, if you have a, a already a client cold email that you sent out and keeps landing in spam. So you can put that into warm up inbox as well and it will just warm that up for you and actually correct its reputation so you don't land in the spam full time email. So that's a very big advantage that this one shares. As for uh, another advantage that this has is that it's uh, you can have as many inboxes as possible. So if you are warming up 10 inboxes, you can have 10 inboxes inside one account and it just helps you do that. The second one is Lemwarm, uh, which is part of Lemlist. I'm pretty sure people who are aware of cold email have heard of Lemlist because that's currently the trending, <laughs> trending software that everybody uses to send out their cold email including myself and I totally recommend it. It's a bit on the expensive side, but it does its job really well. It's very easy UI to use. It does everything really well. It tracks all your statistics really well. So I 100% recommend Lemlist. Uh, as for Lemwarm, that is the, the Lemwarm is another feature that they have basically, uh, which sends out personalized emails. So this is something that Warm Inbox doesn't do. So this would use the name, this would use a personalized approach to it and actually create conversations in a thread format. So with warm up inbox, you just have one email back and forth versus on Lemlist or Lemwarm, you would have a conversational style of uh, conversation. So it'd be three, four, five emails in a, in under the same thread that will automatically create more credibility for your email. And yep, it's like I said, it's one, one of those things that I love about it. Uh, I personally use Lemwarm for everything that currently I'm doing. I used to use warm up inbox, but I've just seen much better results with Lemlist. And it's, it's basically, it automates it and keeps it on the same thread, like a conversation. And even though it is a bit on the pricier side. So if you're just taking the Lemwarm feature is $25 a month, which of course compared to $9 a month is pretty, is a lot. You can warm up two and a half domains with that amount on warm up inbox, but it's something that if you want to start your email outreach faster, I would recommend Lemlist so you can just warm it up for two weeks. Uh, the, the approach that I'm currently using is that the current domain that I'm using, I always have on Lemlist and I have a few domains on warm up inbox just getting uh, warmed up because warm up inbox works better if you have it for a minimum 30 days. While Lemlist, even if you have it for 14 days, you should see pretty good results for it. So I've never faced a spam issue since I've started using both these softwares. And I would 100% recommend you do the same because, uh, yeah, if you land in the spam box, then it's all over for you. Let me know if there are any other tools that you use that you want me to explore. Or if you just want me to go in depth on how to set up Lemwarm or how to set up a warm up inbox, I'd be happy to do that as well. And just hit the like button and subscribe for more such content and for more such videos. And I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.